Today I am going to show you how to use the content aware fill feature. Uh, this feature is insanely helpful if you have, say, a, a drone that's flying in a shot and you see a shadow of the drone and you want to remove that shadow, you can take that shadow out of the, the frame. All right. So I already have this pre-masked out because this plane was moving all over the place um, and it was just, it was the struggle getting it to go back and forth and I didn't want to put you guys through all that stress. So as you can see, the plane kind of bounces around in between the bounding box that I created. And the way that you do this is you bring your footage into a new composition. So we'll start there. Um, and what you want to do is you want to see where the plane is going to be moving around and you'll go grab the pen tool and you highlight all the spots that you think are going to be used for the plane. Um, and what I like to do is I actually like to keep this, the mask. You also want to make sure that this is a mask that you create within the actual video itself. Um, it's, that's it's key for this entire effect. Uh, what I like to do is have this turn to add so that I can see within the video where this is going to actually be moving. And as you can see right here, it, it pops out a little bit. So you want to drag that across, make sure you don't have any of that moving. Um, and since I already have this all planned out or all sketched out already, I'm just going to go back to my other one. But the concept is to, to move all of the, the points so that you're covering the entire um, object that you're going to be removing. So I'll go back to this. Uh, I have this all completely sketched out, so it's, it's perfectly fine the way it is. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go over here and open up Content Aware Fill. If the, you don't see this on the right hand side, you can go up to window and then check this off right here and you'll be good. So what you'll go and do is you'll make sure that your, your video is highlighted and then you'll go into here. Actually, you want to create this and do subtract because you want to take away that, that object. And from there, you want to make sure that this is under object as well as work area. And then you click generate fill layer. So what it'll do, it takes a little while. Um, I'll speed up through this uh, after I explain this. So what this is doing right now is it's going through each single frame and showing what the pixels are going to be for the fill layer that's going on top of it. So this fill layer will fill up all these empty pixels and it will generate using Adobe's um, AI and it will, show you new a new video that's filled in all of those little pixels so i'll speed this up so you guys don't have to worry and sit through this at all all right so you can see here that every pixel has been shifted so that you can see the entire video without the airplane in it so what it has done is it took all the empty pixels that are in this video below and replaced it with this fill layer. So each single frame has been shifted so that you could see the, the video below added in with this top fill layer. Thank you guys so much for watching. 